Hey everyone, it's Wadi and welcome back to the second member of my Ruby Virgin exclusive quest. Today I'm going to be going for a shiny C dot. And actually I just wanted to talk a bit about this because I am going to be doing a repel trick for it. It is a level 4 repel trick, which is also the routes repel trick. And it only brings C dot and Lotet up by about 5%, but at the same time it brings down Zigzagoon and Wurmple by 5%, making them all roughly 25%. So I think it's personally worth it. On top of that, it brings routes up about 6%, which is always nice to have. Uh, just, you, know, you never know. But I do expect him to, f I am expecting to be phasing a lot here um, between low tad and seed up, but hopefully I can get lucky. But 25% uh, is quite a bit, but still 75% chance I won't get it. Anyways, I'll do the first encounter. And then I will see you guys back when C dot decides to shine. So yeah, there's our regular Poochiana. But yeah, I will see you guys uh, when something shines. See you guys in a bit. Shiny C dot, yes! Shiny C dot first phase. Are you kidding me? Oh my god! No way! I saw that. I th I've been shining on C dot so much. Oh my god! Oh my god! And it's on the bright. After how many is that? Two thousand two hundred and twenty-seven. I got it first phase. A tw oh my god. Alright, let's turn this off. Turn up the bright. And hold on, I'll cut the video here. And I'm gonna go to single screen. So give me a second. Alright guys, I'm back. And oh my god. I can't believe I've actually got this first phase. Obviously, I still need to get low tad. And the sapphire but oh my goodness I was staring at that so hard I was like it looks a bit more orange hopefully this is focused enough because it's on the bright so it looks even more um, brownish orange than usual oh I can't believe it I was actually doing the routes repel trick for this to bring it up only five percent and that's not much, but it clearly worked. I can't believe this. 2,227, that's so fast as well. Alright, uh, this game doesn't have a lot of balls, but um, we should be good. Didn't even need to go to sleep. Oh my goodness, shiny C dot. Let's see if we can tell the difference on the decks. All right, there we go. There's a regular she dot. <laughs> she dot. Well, there's a female. There's a regular C dot. And then shiny C dot. I can't believe I got that first phase. Oh my god. Take that, Oleg. No. <laughs> nah, he's still the phase king. But oh my god. Alright, so I'll cut the video here and I'll go get it from the PC. I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, I'm back at the PC. So we'll get the new shiny C dot and show it off in a couple of encounters. Uh, I've got a couple of nature guesses here, so let me just read those out real quick, see what it is. Now Ashley guesses modest. Ole guesses careful. I guess quirky. Oh, Shino guesses quirky. At uh, everyone else guesses modest, so <laughs> not a variety, but let's check it. And it's naive, which um, that's not really anything for it. That's not good or bad, so that's fine. 
Oh my god, I can't believe I got this first phase. I know, like, yeah, the repel trick only brings it up by like 5%, but as I probably explained in the intro, it brings down Zigzagoon and Wurmple, and then routes up to 10%, so I think it's worth it. But anyways, there's a regular Zigzagoon. And shiny Sea Dot, that looks so vibrant. I'm so happy I got this on the bright. Oh, we can't run away, cool. That nature is really not doing it any good. But yeah, it looks so much more vibrant, and that's why I kept shinoing on it. Just because of how bright it is, and I kept thinking it was orange, but then... I didn't see the text come across, and I was like, oh, that's shiny. So yeah, regular routes. And shiny Sea Dog. Alright, so I will... Um, I am going to show off the evolution, so I will see you guys back when this is a Nuzleaf. See you guys in a bit. Alright guys, I just leveled up Dot to level 14, so we'll get to see it evolve into Shiny Nuzleaf. And then I'll show it off in probably uh, just one encounter, and then I traded over a Leaf Stone. So I'll be able to show it off as a Shiny Shift Tree right away. There it is. My goodness, that looks so good in 3rd gen, and especially on the Bright SP. The orange is so vibrant. I do really like Nuzleaf Shiny. Oh yeah, almost went for the leaf stone straight away. Okay, so we'll show it off as a Nuzleaf. We have a regular Makuhita. And then, look at that, shiny Nuzleaf. What a drastic change. Alright, so we'll get the leaf stone I've traded over. Put it on the Nuzleaf. And then get our shiny shift tree. And then we're actually going to go straight back to Granite Cave after this and go for Mawile, so hopefully that doesn't take too long. But once again, I am expecting to phase. There we go, look at that. Not the biggest difference in the world, but still quite a nice change. So I'll show it off as a shift tree and then I'll end the video there. Get an encounter. There we go. Alright, once again, regular Makuhita. And shiny shift tree. Really like the tin it has on its, I guess, fur? Hair? I don't know what to call it. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. And if you enjoy my content in general, feel free to subscribe. And yeah, good luck on all your hunts. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.